are forced to foul Langlo again. Virginia now by five. Langlo misses the second. Davis gets the ball, drives, and Virginia lets him shoot. The lead is cut to three with less than 10 seconds to play. Langlaw is fouled immediately. Two perfect shots would ensure the most important victory in Virginia basketball history. Langlaw makes them both. One last Tar Heel desperation pass fails. The Virginia Cavaliers have done it. 67 to 62. To claim the crown, they had to upset each of the three top-seeded teams. Never before had this been done. Playing their finest consistent basketball of the season, Virginia had made believers of everyone. Three days of grueling competition. Three days of exhausting exertion. Three days of psychologically draining pressure. All of this is rewarded tonight. Billy Langlow, Mark Ivoroni, and Wally Walker join North Carolina's Mitch Kupchak and Phil Ford and Duke's Tate Armstrong on the all-tournament team. And Wally Walker is named the most outstanding player. Virginia's victory did prove once again the Atlantic Coast Conference Tournament is the most frenzied, unpredictable three days of pressure basketball anywhere. For Virginia, it was a night to celebrate.